Good morning. So it is nine o'clock on Saturday and Caitlin and I are going to Canada. We live about two hours uh, south of Canada. Caitlin, what are you doing? Oh, you're uh, a lump yeah. in your bed and you're supposed to be getting up. I don't want to be on camera. Why is that, Caitlin? Because I look like crap. Well, give me a little peek sneak. <laughs> you don't look like crap. Oh, look at your pretty nails. <laughs> Caitlin, don't be antisocial. It's time for you to get up. I'll be social once my face gets put up. It's put on in a while. Your face gets put on? Yeah. Oh, I see. Oh, well, you're going to get Caitlin? Go get Caitlin up. You get her up. Wake up, Caitlin. Get her. Wake her up. <coughs> Wake her up, sonny. Say, get up, you. Get up. Get up, Caitlin. Get up. <laughs> Did he get you? <laughs> you found her. You found her, sonny. Yay. <laughs> Good job. Good job. You did it. You did it. Okay, so makeup is on. I'm not wearing my glasses, so if I look weird. Um, I did something different with my lips. I went with kind of a nude lip. And um, I've tried to like film without doing um, my glasses, but I get... I don't know if it's from wearing glasses all the time, but I get this puffiness, like right in here. It's been raining for so long, so it's kind of crazy outside, and it is still kind of raining. Peyton wears just light makeup. Remember to blend around the hairline and yeah, under your chin really well. You know what helps me? is if after I've put on my foundation, I take my mirror and I go outside in the natural light and I look around and because the natural light is different than in the bathroom, it's a little shadowy. So um, if I'm worried about that or if I'm having an issue with my foundation, a lot of times that helps. So I'm not saying you need to rub off your foundation. I'm not no, saying it doesn't look right perfect. Caitlin um, gets this. No, it's okay. Let me see. Turn your face. Maybe somebody would have an answer. She gets this redness here, and it's not rosate, ros rosacea. Um, and we've gone to the dermatologist, and they gave her some medicine for it. But um, we've done this amylactin, and I mean, she's tried all of the like prescription um, face creams and stuff, and it's not a breakout. It's just like a, a red dry discoloration, and it, and it's dry. So if you guys know of anything that maybe you've used or that would help, that would be great because we've been looking. So get your hair dried and, and we're gonna, I would like to eat breakfast and go here in a little bit, okay? So we are taking the new truck with us to Canada. I started it! And Caitlin started it, yay! So I've just got, I bought this necklace at Forever 21. Isn't it pretty? Or no, Claire's. And it, uh, I got the matching earrings. So since the necklace is so big, I go with the smaller earrings. And this is Caitlin's scarf, but I yep. like the color. <laughs> um, and in my shirt, it has, I don't know if it picks it up very good, but it has all sorts of colors. It's really yeah, it frilly. Does. Stop, Sunny, what are you doing? Sunny, go lay down. Um, so I wanted to bring in a pop of color. I just went with a neutral little jacket flowy i like because i'm uh top heavy a little <laughs> i like doing flowy things that kind of draw the attention away from this area <laughs> yeah. and then i just have uh some blue jeans uh and my uh black little pumps oh and then this is caitlin's headband that i bought for her at claire's but i like it um usually i can't wear these types of headbands but this one stays in place and it doesn't give me a headache and I get headaches pretty easy, so that's my outfit of the Getting day. Getting out of the house is like a miracle, <laughs> seriously. So um, while she's getting her socks on, because uh, she forgot to put socks on, one of the things she did, we've been listening to this um, book on tape called Evermore, and it's um, about this teenage girl who falls in love with this immortal 
boy. I, I try and listen to like the teen books and um, the ones that my daughter wants to read uh, on CD or try to read them before she does so I can see how, if they're racy. Sometimes they get pretty um, bad in those books and they're rated for teens. So that one, that one's pretty good so far. I mean, they, they talk a little bit about sex and a couple times there's some swear words, but overall it's better than a lot of the books that I've heard. And in this new truck, uh, it does not have a CD player. It has, uh, you know, everything is made to connect Bluetooth and USB and all of that. Um, so we couldn't listen to the CD. So Caitlin came up with an idea and decided to bring my laptop so she could hook it up and the, the truck has Wi-Fi. So we're going to um, listen to to the book on this, the um, laptop. I thought that was very ingenious. Um, I wanted to kind of show you a little bit of this truck. It is so cool inside. It's a mess right now. My husband has some of his work stuff. This is actually his office. Um, he works out of this and, and so it's been a real blessing. Here's the dash. Um, it has like voice recognition. It has Bluetooth. It has what's called Uconnect. So it's a hot spot. Um, it has uh, heated seats. So my butt's warm. And it has a heated uh, steering wheel, which is really cool. This center console, there's, there's some garbage in here. But it has, um, this is for you to actually run like a laptop in here. It has a USB, it'll take an SD card. So if you put music on an SD card, auxiliary, auxiliary connections, uh, you can put, um, I think probably video over on this big screen. And then it also has this big um, storage. They thought of so many neat things with their storage capacity. Uh, it has another 12 volt connection and it has a power plug-in. So when you're, you have your laptop in here for work, you can um, charge it. Uh, it has AC, uh, has all of this screen stuff. Um, it has four wheel drive. The seats fold up in the back, but it's the four door version. So it's got a lot of room in here. We bought these mats that uh, cover the floor. And then what's neat is on the floor, it has these storage compartments that you can um, put like ice in there and it's like a little cooler. It's the 2013 Dodge um, Sport, uh, I think 1500. And uh, it just, they've really figured out all of the like technical stuff, um, adding all the Bluetooth. Uh, it's got Cirrus for free for like a year. You, it connects to your phone and there's speakers all around. It's got the Alpine sound system. You can do traffic and weather on here. Navigation. So I can do full navigation. Okay, can we go though? Yeah, I think so. I'm just waiting for it to work. Ah, I did it. Hi. Hey. So, um, we actually are in Canada now and we forgot to take video. We went to Hearst Knot Springs and we did a little shopping and we were going to take video, but it was pouring down rain. So we actually turned right back around. We did a little shopping. We went to the Harrison Hot Springs Resort, um, drove around the lake a little bit. Uh, Caitlin doesn't like the food here very much. We bought some candy, some chocolate, and she's, she didn't like how it tasted she wanted so she wanted to go back to uh, America to eat <laughs> dinner so um, we're right now at the border I'll show you we are waiting in border traffic to go through customs to get, the right there. to get back into the US so there you go so we did, we did film in Canada. <laughs> so we'll, uh, we'll talk to you later. Bye.